Page four. The, the magic garden. The magic garden was in a school playground. It was very pretty. Sunflowers and roses stood high against the wall. There were also marigolds, poppies, and pansies. The sunshine fell on this garden more than on any other, and the flowers danced and sang happily. They said to one another, "We have hundreds of little gardeners. They were the children from the school." One sunny morning, the flowers were talking to the birds. I love all the children, but I love the dear little ones most of all," said a poppy. "I like them to bring their watering cans and water my thirsty roots." "Yes," said the marigolds. "The boys are good to us too. They dig the ground so well." Page four. Page five. We love the little children," said a tiny bird. "They are kind, and they bring bread for us." All the flowers said, "We must work hard to make our dresses very pretty, for the children will be here soon." The sun said, "I will help also." For nothing pleases me better than to see the children running about in the golden sunshine. Suddenly, the children came out laughing and singing, and the flowers stopped their songs to listen to them. Oh, look at the tall sunflower," said one child. And the sunflower lifted its head very proudly. Another child said, "I love the marigold in its golden dress." The marigold smiled happily. Page six. It was indeed a magic garden, because it had fairies too. They danced and sang sweet songs, which only the children could hear. After a time, the fairies came out dancing and talked with the children. Their dresses were made of flowers, and their wings of sunshine. The magic garden was quiet that night. The flowers and birds were asleep and dreaming of the next day when the children would come again. Adapted from the Fairy Garden by Margaret H. Bolton. New words: magic, garden, gardeners, playground, sunshine, golden. Dreaming. Page seven. Reading is fun. One. Why did the flowers love the little children? Two. Why did the birds love the children? Three. Name five flowers growing in the magic garden. Four. What sounds could the children hear in the garden? Talk time. Roses. I like roses. Most roses are red. Some are white. Some are yellow. Are there blue roses? I have not seen any blue roses. Which one is your favorite flower? Learn its name. In English, say aloud. Little, people, purple, happily, sleepily, proudly, slippery, thirsty, pretty. Team time. Activity: 
Make a flower scrap book. 1. Collect five flowers. Page 8. 2. Put each flower carefully between the pages of an old book. 3. Place some heavy books on top of the old book. Leave it for some days. 4. Stick the pressed flowers carefully in your scrapbook. 5. Write the name of each flower. Word building. Name two words in each petal which you see in a garden. Insects. Trees. Birds. Tools. Flowers. Page 9. Let's write. 1. Imagine you have a big garden. What would it look like? Draw a picture here. 2. What would you like to grow in your garden? Write three sentences giving the names of the flowers that you might like to grow in your garden. 1. In my garden, I would like to grow... Dash. 2. In my garden, I would like to grow... Dash. 3. In my garden, I would like to grow... Dash.